Hi, Chris Wallace from Second Swing. We're at Ping headquarters today in Phoenix, Arizona, talking about brand new G410 products from Ping. Got Marty Jerton with us, helping us out today. Marty, we're gonna talk specifically right now about the fairway woods. I know you're super excited about these, both in terms of the new technology, as well as the fact that there's three unique models available to really kind of fit the needs of any player. Yeah, the G410 fairway woods are hot. Uh, they get the ball in the air easy, which is a lot of people have anxiety about that in their fairway <laughs> woods. And then we have great fitting options and we've done some, some fun changes to the model offerings uh, with this line. Yeah, let's start first maybe by going through each of the, the three models, kind of who they're designed for, and then we can talk about some of the shared technology. Yeah, absolutely. So we'll start with the, the, the G410 and we offer this in a three wood through a nine wood. So we have a lot of loft offerings. This is the great overall balance design, like we talked about, has a lower center of gravity, so more efficient, lower spin. A lot of loft offerings. This is just the great starting point uh, if you're looking for fairy woods, the G410. It's gonna fit a lot of players. Uh, next to that, we have the SFT, and SFT stands for Straight Flight Technology. You can see the head is much bigger, so a lot bigger profile. The inertia is a lot higher. Uh, it has weighting that's biased towards the heel, just like the SFT driver, so it turns over easier. These have more loft on them as well, Chris, so the three wood starts at 16 degrees, okay. so it's kind of that four wood loft. If you struggle getting the ball in the air, or if you struggle with hitting kind of that weak fade, the SFT is the place to look, and we make this in a three, five, and seven, so, so a wide range of loft offerings. And then, Really fun for the G410 family, the one you're holding is the LST. So no longer are we make, making the, the strong lofted, kind of more driving uh, only club in the stretch. Now the LST has 14 and a half degrees of loft in the standard position, much lower spin. It's gonna spin about 500 RPMs less than the G410. So, so if you're somebody who produces a lot of spin or rises their fairway wood, use off the tee a little bit more as a driving style club, the LST is a lot of fun because it now, now it has a traditional loft of a three wood, but a lot lower spin, a center of gravity is just lower and a little bit more forward to, to uh, appeal to both the better player or if you're a player that just spins your fairway woods a lot. And for players who are familiar with the stretch, while that was sort of an oversized three wood from a profile standpoint, you've actually gone smaller with the LST, really a compact head shape. Yeah, so it gives you that kind of compact tour head type of look. And so this was driven a lot actually by working with our tour players and really giving them a compact, low spin, plenty of loft so you can launch it in the air, but produces a flat trajectory. All these fairway woods are super hot. So they're driven by the Mirazing C300 face and in doing so, the CORs or the CTs are right at that limit, so we can produce plenty of heat and plenty of ball speed. And you talk specifically about CG position and the LST being more forward to lower spin, but even in the G410 and the SFT, one of the big technology stories is what you've done with the CG location to drive that performance. Yeah, so the face heights are just a little shallower and we've reduced the crown thickness and we have a more efficient back weight design than we use for custom weighting the heads. And the sum of all these things, along with saving some weight from the face, we've lowered the CGs across the board here by 10%. So by moving the CG lower, we're getting more efficient energy transfer, we're lowering spin, we're e increasing launch angle. And you're just having less of those shots you hit with a fairway wood that feels like you hit it low on the face or thin because we're just getting better alignment and efficiency uh, with, during the impact interval. And in addition, as you've done with the G410 driver models, here also a new adjustable loft sleeve, going to give players more customization options to really kind of get the ball in the window they're looking for and create that exact shot shape they're looking for. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, what, one of the things we've seen is that a lot of players would be best suited by a three wood around 16 degrees. And so now you can take our, our three wood at 14 and a half and with the new sleeve design, put it in the big plus position, that gets it to 16 degrees. So this is gonna be a lot of fun in fairway woods is having the new sleeve design that you can go uh, increase loft or decrease it up to one and a half degrees or a smaller in interval of, of one degree, which will be really good for fitting trajectory, gapping your fairway woods, um, and kind of fine tuning it to your game. 
Uh, this new sleeve design, just like the driver, also has some flat positions, which would be really good to experiment with, depending on if you're playing different lengths or to center your, your uh, impact interval or kind of bias your trajectory. So that's a more nuanced fitting uh, 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 characteristic of the new sleeve design, but it is going to be a lot of fun to have more range uh, from a loft and trajectory standpoint. Yeah. Marty, good stuff. We appreciate it. Thanks. All right. Thanks, Chris.